So going into local disk C, going into windows, system 32 and let's delete this. What will happen? Will my PC explode? Or maybe something totally out of the mind? There is lots of buzzing related to system 32. Some people say you can make your computer faster by deleting it. Some say you can unlock some interesting things. While others believe the browsing data is stored in the system 32. So today in this video, I will delete system 32 from my Windows 11 and we will see how it works. Who knows, maybe your PC shoots up like rocket. Please do not try this at your school, office or home PC. And without further ado, let's get started. So here is my Windows 11 and let me show you the version first of all. So here you can see I'm running the latest of the greatest Windows 22000.120 build. Now wait, before we delete System32, let me tell you what exactly it is. Now System32 stores most important operating system related files. So here it is, it's located in the C disk going into the Windows folder and uh, inside the Windows folder you can see this is our System32. So there we go. Before anything crazy happens, you know, let me clarify, I'm recording this video from my external HDMI capture, good or bad, no matter whatever happens, I can able to record it. So let's see. So here we go guys, 3, 2, 2.5, 1, and here we go. And oh, what is this? You need more permission to perform this action. Wow. Anyways, so let's give the permissions. So right clicking on system 32 and going into the properties. Here you can see going into the security. Now going into the advanced tab, uh, we are going to give some permissions. So first of all, we need to change the owner. So we will add the owner over here to users and check the names and click on OK. So we added the user successfully, but we need to give permission to that user. So here moving into the users, now we will edit the permissions. So here you can see these are the all permissions, full control, modify and other stuff. So I will basically allow everything so that I can easily able to delete it. So clicking on apply. And there we go guys, we should be good to go now. So boom, oh. What is this? Let's click on continue again. Continue, 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 continue. Five hours later. Wow. So I never thought like it would take that long, but it's still, you know, giving me the errors. So I have to continue all. And there we go, guys. After clicking pretty much everything, now we are good to go. Okay, so I will try another method to delete system 32. So let me open up the command prompt and I will put a command over there. It should be much faster in my opinion. So here we go. Let's do this guys. So let's put the command and let's see what happens. The command goes like this. DEL space star. You can see the system 32 directory is already selected. It's the default one. So pressing enter. Now I'm 100% sure so let's press Y here we go guys 3 2 1 boom whoa whoa so looks like guys this time it worked out and you can see it did something it at least didn't give us an error so let me now close this up and we will try to use our windows and let's see how fast it runs so start menu and let me turn off my system oh what? Whoa, like I'm, I'm clicking multiple times and it is not doing anything. Wow. Maybe file explorer will work. So let's go. Oh, what, what, what is going on here? Well, I can't be able to open anything. Uh, let's see Microsoft Edge is working or not. So it is uh, loading up Microsoft Store, nothing. Whoa. Oh, oh, what is this? White screen. Oh my God. What is happening over here? Where is the start menu? Where is Windows? Is it on or off? <laughs> what is happening? Oh my goodness, error. Failure to display security and shutdown options. Oh my God, like, I think we made our PC <laughs> completely <laughs> dead over here. I almost lost the hope, but here what I found. 
let me press alter tab and here you can see i'm getting command prompt so i can at least do something so uh let's let's try to open up a uh, pile explorer so let's put the command explorer.exe and let's see oh it doesn't even know what error to give you it gives you blank error <laughs> wow like this is a paradoxical situation we are running the windows but we already deleted some essential files so how it is running that's the paradox i tried minimizing the command prompt and here you can see the minimized version and if i close this command prompt there's gonna be no hope absolutely so deleting system 32 was a good idea absolutely not guys please do not do this at your own pc especially avoid office or your school pcs i know guys you have lots of frustration but you know you can do much more interesting thing than you know deleting system 32 i waited for a really long time and you know this happened you can see wow what, what is going on like come on from turned out to be like a small thing by the behavior of the windows 11 i can clearly see windows is totally forgot about the concept of windows <laughs> i can select the text but what's the point of that like anything i try to open up with the command prompt it just basically gives us the error because it doesn't know what are you talking about did the most obvious thing which is to reboot my system and here you can see it is preparing for automatic repair and let's see whether windows can recover itself or not now unfortunately you deleted so much data that you have to reinstall your windows at this point you can only like and share this video or probably subscribe to this channel if you haven't did already and i will catch you in the next one goodbye